little surprise for you. We have a <clears throat> request from Instagram to uh, talk about the Nicaragua trip that you have coming up. Yeah, so next Thursday, um, we're headed back to Nicaragua. Um, for those of you that remember, I was there was that four months ago, About three or four months ago. So we're going back to Nicaragua Thursday, I think it's the 14th through 19th. Super excited about it. Um, Nicaragua is a place where I think I'm gonna be going every quarter, kind of from here on out indefinitely. Uh, just really fell in love with the people, fell in love with the mission down there with this ministry called Chosen Children Ministry. And specifically this trip is gonna be a little different. So when we got back from the last trip, you know, the last trip we did a lot of like feedings and revivals uh, at night, um, preaching at these churches, feeding, I mean, sometimes hundreds of people. One of the nights there was like 450 people showed up to be fed, which was amazing. But what we realized, or what I realized when we got back, looking back on the trip is, we really only reached the women and children of Nicaragua. Because if you think about it, you've got a, a, an economy that's completely destroyed. Um, we're in these barrios where most people don't have homes, um, no less jobs, and they can't even provide food for their family. Like it's a daily struggle just to eat. So you have men in these barrios that flat out can't provide for their families. And so we come in and we're going house to house, giving their family food, which is kind of like a stab in the back to that man, to that man of the household that can't provide the food that we're just giving it. And at the end of the day, like giving away food is great for the days we're there, but the day we leave, what happens then? And so when we got back, I was like, man, how do we reach the men of Nicaragua? And so we called a meeting um, with the heads of the organization, the ministry that we went down there with. And we just brainstormed, like, how do we reach the men of Nicaragua? And the idea that we came up with, this is going to be the first kind of test trial of that idea um, next week, is we're going to go down and when we fly in, the second we fly in, we're going straight to one of the churches in one of the roughest barrios um, there in um, Nicaragua. I don't remember the actual town that we're going to be in, um, but they've identified a few men that really need it, uh, really need help, um, but also are, are willing and able. And so we're going to provide them a job. And so we are bringing down some bags of tools. So it'll be a, a bag of tools. Uh, we picked out like the you know, normal tools that you would need um, to do work down there. And we're going to build two houses and two outhouses uh, behind them. And we're going to work with those men. So we're going to teach them how to build a house. We're going to teach them a skill. Uh, we're going to be pouring into them all day, obviously, just in our communication with them and just, you know, kind of loving on them. And then we're going to give them, you know, you know we're going to pay them more than that, the normal daily wage that someone would work there, which is incredibly low. Uh, so we're going to pay them well. We're going to give them bags of food to bring home each night. Um, but now, instead of just like going and giving somebody a family food, they're earning food. So when they go home, man, they're going to be fired up because they just made some money. They just worked all day. They brought home food. They brought home something for their wife. Like they're going to be proud. Their chest is going to be puffed out. Like it's going to be an awesome experience. And then when we leave, they now have some skills. They now have a bag of tools and they can now go try to find work, you know, when we leave. The goal for this trip is to really test it out, figure out any areas that we need to improve upon, um, details that we didn't think of beforehand, so that in March next year, um, we're gonna look to take uh, 15 men down. So if you're a man and you're watching this right now and you're interested in going to Nicaragua with us, uh, we're gonna try to bring like 15 uh, men down there um, to do this again, but this time try to build like 10 to 12 houses.